want to share with you guys this dish towel that I purchased and crocheted this border onto. And the dish towel is from Target. And I saw it a couple weeks ago and I really, that blue color that is in there, I absolutely love. So I went back and purchased it. I think it was like $3.99. And it's one of those, um, first of all, it's a huge dish towel. And I'm just going to use it as decoration on our oven. But it is um, a flower sack dish towel, if you know what that is. They sell plain ones at Target, which I do want to go back and buy some plain ones. But it has that like retro feel to it of the um, old fashioned dish towels that used to be made out of flower sacks. But they do ha they have a pack of four um, just plain ones and I thought it would be great to get some of those and put some different color trims on the bottom of them. So this was my first time trying this. I will put the pattern I used in the description box below. Um, I used regular like uh, weight yarn that was like a weight four but I did buy some cotton crochet thread that's um, a weight three and I really want to try um, making some of those with the cotton crochet thread I'm gonna sit down here um, once I finished this I did from the inside press it pretty good so that it would lay nice and flat um, so you need to just know how to do a blanket stitch and single crochets and double crochets. And like I said, I'll leave the description below for the pattern. Um, you can see how long this is. I only did the one side of it. The other side I just left plain and it hangs very nicely on the oven. Um, it took quite a bit longer than I thought. I saw this on Pinterest and thought I'd be able to just whip it out and yeah it did take a little bit longer but I'm very happy with how it came out and yeah so if you guys have any questions let me know. I, um, I worked this up about a week ago and then completely forgot where I found the pot pattern so I just spent like an hour for finding the pattern again. I mean, it's very simple, but I just wanted to make sure I had all the details so that I could write them out for you guys. So I hope you like it and you guys have a super great weekend. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.